My name is Jonathan Gonzalez, and I have been a member of St. Stephen's for about two years now. Um, I first came here in Easter on April 2010. Um, I am a transplant from San Francisco and actually originally grew up in New Mexico. My spiritual journey has not been linear by any stretch of the imagination. It has been quite a labyrinth, actually, where it's been a, a path, certainly, that I knew I was on, but there were a lot of mazes and a lot of twists and turns in the road. So I grew up, what you would say, as an unconventional Catholic. Um, I grew up Catholic, but never got baptized or confirmed because my parents had a very ambivalent attitude towards religion. And I went through a long period after I lost one of my parents of questioning my faith pretty seriously. I guess my road to Damascus moment was a few years ago when I attended a church service in San Francisco on Christmas Eve. And the priest talked about Graham Greene and some other things that just really, I really felt like I listened for the first time. And um, so I actually went through a pretty intense spiritual journey. And when we um, moved to Houston with our new child and my newfound faith, um, we were really looking for a place that fit our particular spiritual need. Um, I believe that God is everywhere, and it has always been something that I've strived for, to find God in everything and to be aware of God in Christ's presence, not just on Sunday, but throughout the year and throughout the day and throughout the week. So um, finding St. Stephen's was definitely a blessing. Um, I work in the theater, and some people that I work with in the theater were parishioners at St. Stephen's, and so I came on an Easter with my family, and we found just an amazing community and uh, a place of love and a place of love that speaks to me as Christ's love speaks, which is a deep love, but not necessarily a gushy, feel-good kind of love, a challenging kind of love, a powerful kind of love, a fierce kind of love, but there's also a comfort that I felt at St. Stephen's. So there's that, that duality of, of comfort and yet being challenged. I feel like every Sunday we're taught to be tolerant, we're taught to love each other, but we're also challenged to help each other and to love each other. So um, I find it not just a place to escape, it is definitely a place to be quiet, but it's also a place where I feel that I am challenged and reminded of why I'm here and what God's plan for me is. Um, and I definitely see that transformation in others. I see it in my family. My wife and my daughter all come here. The three of us come together as a family and we have, um, just really felt like we were part of a family here at St. Stephen's. And um, I certainly um, feel grateful that I have found a relationship with God where inquiry and questioning are not irreconcilable with the heart and the need to serve. Um, so I feel like God's plan for me, um, as seen through Christ's teachings, is fulfilled for me in a spirit of inquiry, in a spirit of using my brain, um, and also finding that time to listen. And I certainly have time to listen at St. Stephen's. So I am grateful to the clergy, to the fellow parishioners, and to God for, for directing me to this place.